G'day guys, it's Friday afternoon. Time to check back in on the grafting. So it's been five days since I did the grafting. Now I haven't got a smoker going so I'm just going to work away quietly here, try not to upset these bees. So what have we got? So they've made four queen cells. We've got four capped cells. And they rejected two of them. So that's all right. I think they're decent looking cells. Two of them are a bit crooked. I don't know what that means. But I think they're still all right. Now I'm just going to check the their natural cell. This was that coma foundation, so I'll just get that one out of the way. There's a little bit of brood in the middle of that. It's looking okay. This was that comb with the their natural queen cell. There it is there. It's not finished yet. You may recall it just had an egg in it last weekend, last Sunday, so it's a couple of days behind the grafted cells now. So that's it, that's all I needed to know out of this hive. So this is the split I made up with the old queen. I need to know whether they accepted the queen or whether they killed her. If she's not in here, I can use one of the cells and put it in here. So the candy's all been eaten. There is a couple of bees in the cage, but we'll see what it is. Yeah, there's no queen in there. Just a couple of workers in there. So I'll go through and try and find her. So this is just a comb of all honey. This is a brood comb and I can see a few eggs in, in the empty cells. And I can also see a queen cell on the side there, they've made a queen cell. So it's a little bit contradictory that there's eggs in these cells and a queen cell. 
you'd think that if they killed the queen and made a queen cell, there wouldn't be any eggs. So I'm just looking through to try and find the queen. The bees are acting a little bit unsettled to my judgment which can indicate there's no queen present. So I haven't seen her this, this far. So I'll go back through and have another look. So maybe they let her lay for a couple of days and then killed her. It's just a little bit of burr comb there I'm removing. So there's the queen there. I missed her the first time through. The old queen there, she's looking pretty slow. She's not, not moving much. I decided to take that queen cell out because I want to save the old queen. I'd say what happened there was while she was in the cage for a couple of days, they started making a queen cell, thinking they're queenless. And they've continued and, and finished that queen cell, which probably indicates that this queen hasn't got a very strong pheromone. but I'll just persist with her for now. Give them a little bit of feed, just to keep them in a good mood. So this is the little one that I converted, converted from the commercial mini over to this one. I was hoping to see eggs in here today at least. And I just wanted to check what they're like for population. So I remember this was a foundation, little strip of foundation. So they've done a decent amount of work to that. Plenty of bees on it.
So still plenty of brood there yet to emerge. That's the brood I put in there from the other hive, obviously. But yeah, plenty, plenty left there to emerge. Can't see the queen yet. Once again, plenty of capped brood there, yet to hatch. Can't see any eggs at this stage. There are a few empty cells there that the queen could lay in if she, if she was laying, but there's no eggs. But I'm happy with this population. It's it's got the right amount of bees in here. I was a bit worried when I made this up that there wasn't enough bees, but there obviously is now. So she's just a tiny little queen. Not much to look at. I don't know whether she'll grow anymore or not, but she's, yeah, really quite a small little thing. She did come out of an emergency cell, which is not ideal. And the fact she's not laying yet is a bit of a worry. Hopefully she can go out and get mated and, and lay for a bit. I'll just sneak a little bit of feed into these guys as well. The so conditions are pretty hard at the moment. And that's it guys, thanks for watching.